Are you set, are you? Do you know you've got the rags in your hand? Or you've got no room for anything else? Oh, yeah, I... No, you give, give them to me. I can carry them. Because you don't want them in your hand when you need to get a gun straight away, you know? Well, you can, and then if you find, yeah, if you find an IV start kit, you can get one of those things going that gets your blood back up again, you know, but, you know, when you when you haven't got a rucksack on there, you've got to prioritise bandages, ammo, guns, food, and then the other stuff, the medical stuff, other than bandages, is probably a bonus later on then. Yeah, I, oh shit. There's a guy, there's a guy, there's a guy. Two guys. <laughs> No. There's two guys. One ran up the hill. One's hiding behind this bush. It's a zombie. Well, this one's dead. Watch yourself. The other guy ran up the hill. You might have. To, we might have to go back inside. Back where we came from. You know that building? It's okay, I've shut the door. I'm ready to close it when you come back in. Oh, you might have to you might have to go to another one if you have to. Shit, sorry bro. I'm just trying to keep an eye on where his mate went, because he had a friend, so watch your back when you go in the PD because he might have spotted where you went. I'm trying to keep an eye. I told you there was that that deer gave them away. But, um... His friend is probably gonna try and camp the body. Oh, I can see him. He's creeping up the other side of the street, right? Okay, so he's up the hill from where I was shooting. He's crossed the road into the other bushes. If these zombies weren't here, I could try and flank him, but there's nothing I can do a minute. Um... So I've, I can I can see the PD now. I'm in the other room of this two-story. So if he crosses across the car park, I can tell you that he's coming. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm still in there. The guy, I think, has gone for a pretty long flank. There might even be a third party person here now who's heard the shots. I'm trying to keep an eye but not get shot in the face as well. I'm not even worried about what the guy had on him, to be honest. You know, if, the, if all the zombies calm down, then we'll go and have a look after. Yeah, they will. If you um, don't run around, if you stay still. Otherwise, they can hear you, your footsteps, and they'll just keep aggravated. So you've almost got to try, even make sure you've got a gun in your hand, but just sit in a corner somewhere. And they will stop eventually then. But if you hear the door open, zombies can't open doors, so it's 100% the other player. So just... Ah, yeah, yeah, he moved. Um... He moved up the hill away from his friend's body. I can see him. He's running away up the hill. He's crossed left to right. So he's now parallel where I shot that guy. He's up the hill from where his buddy fell. Okay, so he's sort of op he's opposite my building now. But the back side of the building. So I think he's going to make a push at me. Or he's going to stay up the top of the hill and just watch his, bu his buddy's stuff. If, if that makes sense. If he makes a push at me, I should see him coming down through the trees, hopefully. Because i seen him cross the road. He wasn't very uh, inconspicuous. They're slowly departing. What I would say is, if you stay where you are, though...
I want to just try and get eyes on this guy. Oh, the zombies are running towards him now. Uh, I think so. One of them was. No, he went into the bushes. General area. <coughs> um, It looks like he's got a lot of gear, but it can be deceiving. You know, he could be carrying 42 tins of beans. Like, It's not necessarily AK-47s or whatever. And the, the guy I shot at didn't even take another shot back at me, which I was surprised at. And his mate left him to dry, really. Um... <laughs> If the zombies are gone from outside my building, I'm going to try and do a wide flank behind him. So I'm going to come out the... No, if you hold, because if I die, I'll be able to tell you where he is, and then it might be just balls to the wall, all or nothing. But at least you'd still be alive, you know? I, I've run out of my building. <coughs> and I'm... Going for a massive, massive long flank behind him. If I can avoid all the zombies. I got an idea where he is. And oh no. Oh no, please no. The zombies just giving me away. I don't think personally I wouldn't expect me to do this move, you know? But it can it can either go horrendously well or te terrible. Like they I need to get eyes on him again, of course. Um, but he's just going to camp his mate's stuff, so we've got to try and kill him, really. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to loot the body. Uh, and I, know, I suppose we stayed alive, so it is it is still worth it, but you know, we could leave. I'm just worried now of him sort of popping us as we leave, you know. Oh, shit. I've triggered a zombie. I've got to run away. Yeah. So I'm a, I'm up the road now. So I'm sort of... If you were heading out of town, up back towards the medical. I'm in an open field though, so I'm pretty... It. If he's sitting in a tree somewhere, I'm dead. If he's got a sniper rifle. No. <clears throat> I wouldn't yet. Let me just have two more seconds. Well, another minute coming back. I'm coming back down the hill, basically. Towards town. I'm almost trying to be where I saw him enter the trees. And then I'm hoping I get really lucky. And I am come out right behind him and he's sitting in a bush, you know. Otherwise, I might just bump into him face to face and he might just blast me, but... I got him, I got him, two seconds. <laughs> Dunno. Are you a fucking joke and he didn't die? Yeah, he died, he died, yeah, yeah. So stay where you are, stay where you are, because there could be a hundred zombies coming. Just, yeah, yeah, I've got to run, I've got to run into the house, or into a garage. Oh, that was lucky, I came right up behind him. 